Welcome to my channel, where I will take you to some places, let you see my new toys and stuff, and reviews. Stand the man! Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today, I am going to show you a review of Hey Day. So I am, I feel bad to say this, but um, our um, our Singapore vlog day three was was erased. I I don't know why, but it was actually erased. But um, the good thing is, I will do a review about Payday. So first, let me show you the cards. Here are the bargain cards. So there's a lot. And this is how one of the bargain cards look like. So, next, we have one of the most unlucky cards ever mail so this uh, this is an example of mail so this bill it says rent paid the bank 350 at the end of the month what i know is 350 is the most expensive price for a, for a loan so i'm just going to put that here And this is very important, the discard pile. So this carton is used for putting the cards that are not going to be used anymore. For example, I already paid the rent at the end of the month. You, ju you, just, put the, um, you just put the card on the discard pile. So it will not be messed up or you won't keep it. Or maybe you will not get confused. Next, we have event cards so this is an example of an event card this is my favorite the not today cards these not today cards are very helpful when you play payday with your family members your friends or maybe even your classmates next we have the loan record and this is a pen that um yeah this that, that was a pen so this is used for the loan record the loan record already has some writings on it so there me mom and dad so that was when we were gonna play payday Next, we have the nor the number die, the normal one. Next, we have the additional die. So it has plus three. You can sell a bargain. Then you can roll the dice again, and then you can pay, you can buy a, you can buy a bargain or sell a bargain. And um, here, this is actually this means plus three steps. Next. You get a bargain and at the other side you also get a bargain next we have the yellow token it looks like a chess piece if if you know how to play chess or if you have seen chess pieces before this looks like the pawn next is the blue And next we have the green. And lastly, we have the red. So most of the time I use the red token because red is my favorite color, as you know. So, um, So here's the game board. This is how it looks like. 
and start. So you go all the way here. Happy birthday is lucky because you, um, because your opponents have to pay 100 to you. Then lottery, event, bargain, and then daylight savings. If you are the one who landed on daylight savings, you're gonna be unlucky because you're gonna go to mail. And of course the jackpot. So you earn the jackpot at the end of the month. And payday is ages eight plus two to four players also. So it's um, the same like it's almost the same as Monopoly because payday is actually from the makers of Monopoly. So next we have the money. So first let's start with 1,000. So every time you start or every time it's the start of a month, you have to put 1,000 to the jackpot. Next, 500. Next, we have 100. I, in my opinion, I call 100 the most used um, money, um, money. Because every time we play it, um, 100 is always the first that goes bankrupt. 100 is always the one that has like, there's no more 100. All, it's always like that when you play. Next, 50. 50 comes in handy when 100 when all the 100 bills are gone. 20 just in case 50 all the 50 bills are gone. And I call this the less less used paper bill. 10 So payday is actually very very different from Monopoly games and um, yeah. So you have to shuffle the bargains and every time you start you have to put one bargain at the yard sale spot. So here you put it under the game board at that yard sale spot. And whoever lands there, of course, will get that bargain. So, to actually spin or roll the green die, you have to you have to pay one hundred to the bank. If it's if it's the final month if you already ended for example you pick to do two months at the end for example you already finished those two months one remove your token from the board two place any cards you have in the appropriate discard piles three hang out while other players finish the game honestly this has never happened before because I don't really remember the last time I played Payday with the whole family. Not really the whole family, but the family. So, um, when I play this, um, I don't really accept the mark-up mail cards. Mark-up mail cards mean, um, for example, you have to pay 200 to increase the resale price of this bargain, like that. And um, I would also recommend you this game because all the three board games I've already told you so far um, have been great, and it's not good. It never has. It had never been boring before. So yeah, I don't have much to say about this, and. Um, this is a very nice game that I recommend you to play with your family and other other people you know. And I 
think that's it so please um please like and subscribe and please um press the bell button to be notified about my new videos so that's it and i'll see you on my next one bye stand the map